feel like days Only been days, but it feel like months I've been gone for a year, only go like once Life move fast when you do what you want Yo! Ah. Man, it's cold as hell outside, man. Ah, so good to see my car. Bro, it's just, bro, it's the little things, bro. It's the little things. All right, man, we finna go to, uh, if this shit was sit up straight. All right, bro, we finna go to Tom Thumb. I'm finna just pick up some fruit, bro, because I don't know what it is. I haven't been sick lately, you know what I'm saying? I feel like it's been strong. But I remember every, like, spring to summer, I remember just being locked in on my eating fruit and just booyah yah, just staying consistent because the fruit that I always get is watermelon, bro. And I live in Texas, right? So, I mean, really, watermelon still grows in the wintertime. I still can get watermelon, right? It's just not as ripe. And it's not as um, it's not a season, you know what I'm saying. Plus, some of the watermelon here they don't have seeds in it. It be seedless watermelon. And we try to get seeded watermelon. I'm finna just gonna check them out. I might just get watermelon just to get me right back on track. Start eating more fruit again, cause uh, I haven't. I need to just start eating fruit if I don't eat nothing else. I haven't been sick in a while, which is weird. Now, I've been sneezing, sneezing a lot lately. I see the trees that start in the spring. I see springs coming, so my allergies been good. Haven't been sick though, so you know what I'm saying? So I feel like a reset is gonna be coming. So I just wanna make sure I have a lot of fruit in my system, just to, um, just to keep that balance of my immunity system. But it was just like, it was it's crazy, cause it was just 80 degrees two days ago, bro. Now it's like, it's like 50, oh my God. This hoe does not want to stay. Now it's damn near 50 degrees outside. Oh, you hear that sound? I don't like how that sound, man. I don't like how that sounds at all. The fuck? Fuck wrong with my car, baby. Vanessa, you good? You good, baby? But yeah, we finna walk up in the store and see what we get. Number one on the list, we got me some bananas. You feel me? Now we get the watermelon section. And she. See, these are looking good. These watermelons are looking good. I'm getting this bad boy right here. Make sure y'all get y'all water. Got me a jug of water. So, now, there's different types of almond milk you can get. I mean, it's oat milk. I don't drink. I don't drink that cow milk, bro. I stop. Start drinking cow milk in college. So, all I've been drinking is almond milk. Everything's natural, really. Everything natural. I typically go with the silk. Honestly, I might just get two of these. Protein. Bro, oh, these niggas got protein almond milk. Eight, eight times more protein. I don't think they do that shit. Did you go this one? <laughs> never seen that. Let's see. I might just get coconut this way. So I'm slight. Trying to get me some coconut. You know what I had to Hey bro. Let me tell you something. Get you some of light slavery gummies, bro. Trust. I just got some uh, gummy worms sour. But the light slavery gummies, bro. You gotta get the wild. You gotta get the wild berry. They ain't beating that. Damn. I think I went down the wrong aisle. I do want a candle, bro. I do want a candle for my room. I ain't gonna tell. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie.
gotta smell. You just gotta go out there and smell. Mm. Oh. Relax and restore. Hold on, man. Hold on. Smell it real quick. <laughs> yeah, I might go with this one. Hell no. Yeah. We're going to go with this one. I ain't going to lie. Get you some fellas. Get some candles, bro. You got, you got your girl coming over, bro. You got to have your room smelling type of good, bro. It can't be smelling like a stanky, dooty, booty boy. You can't be a boy, man. You gotta be a grown man. Get you some candles. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no, ain't a female thing. All men can work and have some candles, man. Come on, don't let nobody fool you, bro. Don't let nobody fool you. Man. All right, bro. I'm gonna check out. So this will be, this is what we pretty much got. We got some watermelon, bananas, some um, we got watermelon, bananas, almond milk, some candles, some water. Nothing too crazy, bro. Nothing too crazy. I gotta make me a smoothie. I ain't had no. I have fruit. I already have like frozen, frozen fruit already from my smoothies. So I don't really need too much, bro. I could get some strawberries, some blueberries, bro. Those are good. Ah, strawberry blueberries. Ah, I might pass. I might pass. I'm gonna get some oranges. How about that? We can get some oranges, bro. I've been, I've been eating all of my, eating all the oranges. I needed some more oranges. Yeah, it's good. All right, finna check out. Peace. In my video, I couldn't. The audio was kind of bad, but I was talking about the almond milk. I, I start, I started drinking almond milk in college because one of my friends told me, said, "Bro, you still drinking cow milk?" And I didn't really think about it like that, bro. I. And then I had to do my own research on cow milk, and I had to do my research on I'll do my research on cow milk. But it's not like you can't drink cow milk, and you you can drink cow milk and be fine, right? You can drink cow milk and be fine. I say that because. I've been drinking it my whole life. I grew up on cow milk, bro. I had cow, I had milk, cow milk and cereal every day. And then I really just sit and think like we're the only species that drink other animals' milk. Like we should be drinking our mom's milk. That's it. We're drinking cow milk, goat. Like you know what I'm saying? When I did my research, my friend was talking about almond milk. And the almond comes straight from a plant, it comes straight straight from the earth. It comes straight as natural. So what makes more sense? Drinking it from another living or I mean it's all living it's all living things. Everything is living. Plants, it doesn't matter. So it's all living beings, but you're drinking it from another animal, another species, when you could just drink it from the ground, what God gave us, what's natural. What makes more sense? And I thought about it, I was like, wow, did research on it. Cause cow milk comes with a lot of pus, comes with yeast. That's that we don't know. That's we don't know. You may feel fine on the outside, but on the inside, you'll feel like shit. So that's why I had to realize I did my research. I was like, wow. And I know almond milk is better for you because it's it's mainly contains a water. It's, it's straight water and it keeps you hydrated. So that's 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 what took me. It keeps me hydrated. I feel better. So that that's it was a no-brainer for me. So it was an easy switch for me. And it tastes the same just like cow milk. So you wouldn't even know the difference. Now do you bro do your own research like I say, but I I noticed that all milk is just, it just makes more sense to me. Alright. If we could if we could fix the little things. Because we're not going to be perfect, bro. Some shit we're going to eat that we're not supposed to eat. A lot of this stuff is bad for you regardless. Like, at the end of the day, you're going to die. We're all going to die. Right? So, at the end of the day, do what you want to do. You can have that mindset, but... Or you can have the mindset, I'm going to treat my body 
this my body is a temple. I'ma give it what it deserves to eat, you know what I'm saying? I'ma treat it as sacred as much as possible. But it's kind of hard in the society that we live in because I can go in so much deeper in this because it's not just milk, you know what I'm saying? Our foods, our meats, I can get into that so much. Me just eating these uh, candy, like sugar, all this sugar is in here. Right, it's just, it's just a lot, man. But at the end of the day, man, do what do what makes you happy. You know what I'm saying? Try to do your try to do your best. My motto is like I try to eat as clean as possible. Every once in a while, I can I can I can deserve I can eat something like I I shouldn't be eating. If I to me, it's whatever your standards is. You know what I'm saying? So whatever that, whatever goals that you have, my goals is different from your goals. My goals is different from your goals. So whatever your goals is, is it varies. You know what I'm saying? I work out my body as much as possible. I take care of my body as much as possible. So I, I feel I feel like I, I can deserve a nice little, you know, snack every once in a while or bad food every once in a while. You feel me? Hey, bro, this, why is this stand tripping, bro? Oh, it's raining outside, bro. Damn. All right, fellas. So, I'm gonna show y'all what I'm gonna, what I'm about to make in my smoothies, man. I'm gonna show y'all. Been a minute. Been a minute since I've done a video like this. So all you, all you gotta do is get a get to get to a little blender, nothing too crazy. All right, so you just get, I'm about to put y'all on game, bro. All this, all gonna come together. That's why we got the banana. Ooh, I forgot. We got the peanut butter. All right, we got the peanut butter. Doesn't matter what peanut butter you use. Now you can get some whatever you feeling, whatever you got. Use what you got, bro. Use what you got. We got the green tea because we finna go to the gym. So typically I wake up in the morning. If I this is what I eat in the morning, either a banana, some bagels, or a protein shake. So it all depends what I have. So right now, since I have this, I'm making me a protein shake before the gym. This is what I do before the gym. All right, take your take your almond milk. Pour it in here. You put the almond milk first so that way it, it, it cleans up the bottom. When it breaks down, when the blender gets to shredded, it breaks it down smoothly. Check. Now, it doesn't matter what particular order you use. This is the fruit mix I use. You know what I'm saying? This is the organic daybreak blend. Strawberry, peaches, mangoes, pineapple, and shit. You know what I'm saying? I like to put the put. I like to put the uh, frozen first. That's why I didn't want to buy strawberries because I have strawberries. But natural is always better. You know, frozen does it does the job. You know what I'm saying? Keep it nice and cold. So I only put a little bit of that, and then this is my protein powder. Um, I I experiment with a lot of protein powders, bro. I use Bless. It was a natural plant based. I went from plant based. To um, there's another one, rice, rice protein, um, protein powder, and then now I have, I have my own business. I have my own products. I use my products as X's. Link will be in the description. So these are the pods. Normally the pods you can just you rip open, it just comes on out. But you can get the scoop version in the description. But this one's the pods where you can just it dissolves in milk and it just it, it blends itself basically. So it's like the easier version. Now it does get messy, so you gotta be careful. Probably should put the banana. Oh, I should probably put the banana first. Are we good? Boom. Oh. oh. Boom. Hey, yeah, hey, yeah. Cause I ain't, I ain't eat nothing today, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I've been cleaning all day. So I ain't been doing too much, bro. I ain't been doing too much. 
All right, what's next? Probably a little bit more milk. Just, just, just a ugh. You know what I'm saying? Next is banana. I feel like that's the next part. It should be banana. You feel me? Eyeball it. You ain't gotta look. You ain't gotta cut it up like some. Cut it with the scissors and put it in there. If you wanna get fancy, yeah, you get fancy. We just doing that. Keep the last one for yourself. Next, we got peanut butter. Really, one scoop is cool. Just because it's so thick, it ain't gonna blend it up all the way, but I do two. You just gonna do two, cause that peanut butter be going crazy. That motherfucker go crazy. Mm. All right. Boom. Next. <laughs> it's a lot of stuff that go in here. That's why I say I'm, I'm giving me, I'm working on giving me a bigger blender, just because I can pack more stuff in there, but. Take a scoop of cream tea. I use the thorn, the thorn cream tea, man. I've been using this since high school, man, since college, bro. You know what I'm saying? Cream tea basically just enhance your performance a little bit, recovery, you know what I'm saying, faster. You know what I'm saying? That's all it does. Nothing crazy, but it's the little things, brother. It's the little things. But you, you can't perform well if your diet ain't right. So make sure you get your diet right. That's all I got to say. And then put a little extra fruit on top. Just a little extra fruit on top. And then you just drown it in some milk. Mm, not, not all the way. Don't drown it. I mean, I said drown it, but don't drown it. Boom. Should be good. It's going to be a... This is a ninja, so this, this it, it better chop up anything. I give it. It might be good, though. Hold on. Make sure the top is screwed on tight. Yeah, it might leak a little bit, see? Too much milk. It's all good. Boom. Now we in business. <laughs> We should be good. Should be cool. You can't tell me this shit don't look good. Hold on. Can't tell me this shit don't look good. You know what I'm saying? Not. We gotta do the taste test. Boom. I mean, I shouldn't even have to taste it. I already know. <laughs> You really want some gains? Get you some shakes. Get you some smoothies. Hell yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. You don't need to go to Smoothie King, brother. I paid $30 for this. Well, technically. Probably a little bit more than that because I didn't get the fruit. I already had the fruit, had the peanut butter, had the cream tea. But, hey, brother, you could have got some strawberries and, you know what I'm saying, some blueberries. You know, it would have done the same thing. You feel me? Put some ice. The reason why that's the frozen comes in handy because it's cold. So just put some ice in there if you have to. Little tips like that, man. That's all it takes, man. That's all it takes. Just like that, you ready to go. Make sure you clean up after yourself the best you can. Sure. This blender is so hard to clean, though. Fuck like it. Fuck like it. And that's it, man. That's all it is to it, man. Some slight, some slight. Now we're ready to go to the gym. Get it. Alrighty. All right, back on the road again. I'm gonna have to get some gas, huh? <laughs> Everything costs. <laughs> Everything costs. Oh, shit. Nah, but I lied. Um, We gotta do, we gotta do one more errand. 
I'll just do the other errand another day. I need to go get my suit. Now, fellas, I got me a suit because every man needs a suit. I got, like I said, I got an event this weekend. I'm gonna vlog that. So that's gonna be a nice little thing for myself. I never own me a suit. I mean, I had a suit when I was little, and you know, as you get older, I mean, as you get older, you outgrow your suits and it doesn't fit anymore. So now that I'm like 20 some, so I'm shit. I need me at least. Uh, I'm gonna get my first, I got my first ever suit. I'll probably add on some more suits like every year, once a year. I don't know. But since I'm in business and stuff, so I need to start investing into my appearance a lot more. You know, I just wanna start having different types of styles that I can rock in different type of seasons, you know. So spring's coming, so there's gonna be a lot of nice little, nice little dressing going on, but you know what I'm saying? So that's what I'm, that's what I'm striving for. That's what I'm hoping for. And uh, yeah, man, so every man needs a suit. Every man needs a suit. That's all I gotta say. If you don't agree, hey, bro, he tripping. <laughs> Y'all finna see it too. Y'all finna see it. And then, and then we're gonna slide to the gym. All right, then we're gonna slide to the gym. I need to hit legs like crazy. I need to hit legs, bro. If the, if I don't do one thing, it's gonna do legs and chest. Everything else is great. I just and my shoulders. I keep saying that. Just legs. Not like a crazy type of leg day, but a crazy leg day. You know what I'm saying? Cause I just, bro, legs just be so. It be so hard for me. Like, like chest. As far as like upper body goes, you can get you some dumbbells. I mean, you can get you some dumbbells and do some legs too. But it's for chest, bro, you can do some push-ups, some pull-ups, and you good. You know what I'm saying? Bro, it's been oh, hey, I ain't gonna lie, that new protein I got, man, this shit go crazy. <laughs> this shit go crazy. But yeah, if you really want to lose weight on some real, like real spill, man, real steel, you gotta be in a calorie deficit. All right, so that mean, what is calorie deficit? Hold on. I don't know why I go this way. I always go this way. But being a calorie deficit means that you got to eat less to burn fat. All right? When people ask me, and I tell them, calorie deficit. And a lot of the times, it just goes over the head. It's, it's, it's easy said than done, bro. It is easy said than done. Like, for myself, bro. Oh my, hey, they got wings. Hold on, hold on. But for myself, bro, I just, like, I never let myself, like, I still struggle with my body. I, but I never let myself just gain so much weight to where I'm just, like, I'm too big and I have a, a, big, a big gut. I never let myself do that. Now, I'm still trying to work on my body to get it to where I'm trying to get it at. But it is a lot of, it is a lot of work that I need to do to my body that I'm, I'm still striving to get. Cause I still got fat that I'm, I'm trying to hit like, what clear cut abs. For me, like my body size, I have to really watch what I eat. But that shit be so hard. Cause I, it's not like I eat a lot. Right, I don't, I don't only eat like once or twice a day. Snack on little snacks here, here and there, every here and there. But the thing is, when I do eat my meals, I overeat. So basically, I'm eating about three or four meals a day. You could say that, you know what I'm saying? Three, probably three. 
a high three, maybe pushing four, a small four, right? Four meals a day. But I really eat twice a day. So it's really the portions, how much am I eating? And it, it, I, I, it's not like I eat till I'm full, never eat till you're full, but I eat till like I'm 75%, 80%. Like I'm good, like I'm good to go, you know what I'm saying? I'm good for a couple hours. And it's also what you eat. If you eat, there's a difference. If you're eating a lot of good, good food, you can eat a lot of good, good food. But sometimes I eat a lot of, it'll be like two bad food, two bad meals, right? Two bad meals and that has a lot of fat, hella, hella carbs and that, and that's about like three meals itself. You know what I'm saying? Off maybe off of one meal it might be two meals by itself because of what I'm eating. So if I'm that's why I gotta have balance of towards eating veggies and your protein and your carbs and you gotta you gotta you gotta eat all those type of things, you know, so have those in your diet, have it well balanced, you know what I'm saying? You don't wanna overeat, you know what I'm saying? You don't want protein, protein, protein. For the longest I used to eat protein, protein, protein. Not as much, and then vegetables. I always eat my no. I was I always eat fruit, but vegetables I would like. You know what I'm saying here and there. So it's important you just gotta get your veggies. And when you're trying to supplement stuff like say a pro like eating protein shakes, drinking protein shakes all the time, that's not real food. You know what I'm saying. So you gotta eat. You gotta fill your body with some real food. So that way you come back to come back at your ultimate. My biggest thing, I do eat a lot of sugar. I eat a lot of sugar, you know what I'm saying? But other than that, as far as protein, and I'm being better on my diet, you know what I'm saying? But I could be a lot better, you know what I'm saying? I could be way better. Just because of the resources I have, I just, I eat, I, I'm a type of person, if someone cooks a meal for me, I'm, I'm not gonna, even though I'm like, bro, I don't really need this, but I'm not gonna waste the food, you know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna waste food. I'm gonna clear plate it, I'm gonna I'm I'm finish it. That shit's over with. You leave some food around me, that shit's gone. Like, that shit's gone, bro. Like, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry. <laughs> you feel me? Like, we don't waste food. When you when you grew up on nothing, you ain't have shit. Yeah, I'ma eat whatever, bro. I'ma eat, I'ma eat whatever is, is, is offered to me. But if I made it, I'm more, I'm more like, okay, I know what I need to eat. I know what I'm missing in my diet. You know what I'm saying? It's all, you just gotta pay attention to what you're eating, bro. Really all it is. You, Cause you can eat whatever you wanna eat. I'm not, like bro, you can eat what you wanna eat, but you gotta pay attention. If you eat a lot of bad shit back to back days, okay, now it's time to, okay, balance. Okay, now I gotta, I gotta go a couple of days just eating straight fruits, veggies, and maybe less on the carbs and protein. To get my protein elsewhere, like, you know, just eat, drinking protein shakes or, uh, eat something that doesn't contain meat because you don't always have to have meat as protein. You can have other supplements as protein. Try different diets. Try different. Go keto. Try throw some keto and th throw plant based into your diet. You know what I'm saying? Throw some uh, tofu in your diet. Throw beans, beans and rice and veggies. That's it. You know what I'm saying? Like throw in some of the, those type of things, and then come back to like eating your fried chicken, fried wings, fried a big ass juicy burger and I don't even eat burgers like that if I make if I eat a burger I make it myself I don't eat fast food and stay away from fast food and try it as much as possible to stay away from that fast food you know what I'm saying but every once in a while you eat you some fast food you eat fast food one day maybe twice don't beat yourself up you had a pizza and then have fast food the next day and then all right the, 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 the next three days what you need to be doing getting the veggies in, eating more fruit and really going to cleanse. You know what I'm saying? So I'm looking at it. I'm trying to look right so I can get over. You know what I'm saying? It's really simple, bro. Like it's really easy. It's, it's not it's really easy, you know what I'm saying? Once you've been doing it for so long, it's easy. And then just drink you some water, dog. Drink water. You can drink some alcohol. You 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 alcoholics there, you know what I'm saying? I know y'all some alcoholics. Am I, you know what I'm saying? Ain't nothing wrong with a little drink. You know what I'm saying? Feel me? Ain't nothing wrong with a little drink. But, you know what I'm saying? You got to have balance, my boy. I'm a wine drinker, man. I'm a, I'm a wine drinker, baby. You know what I'm saying? I like, I like my wine. All right? I like my wine. All right? You know what I'm saying? I'm getting to that age. I need some wine. I don't need that hard liquor. But I will drink it. I don't smoke. I used to smoke all the time, bro. I used to smoke all the time. And that's when I was first getting into it. I was like... 
high school, during high school, after high school too, my first two years in college too, smoking, man, I was like, man, I gotta lock in. And that's when I just started drinking. I had my phases just drinking all the time. So this was like, hey, it be tough out here, you know what I'm saying? It be tough out here, but you know what I'm saying? We better now. We gotta get back in the gym and start taking care of our body. I think the biggest thing for me is just my, what my diet is, eating better. Yeah, eating better and then the gym will come by itself. <laughs> it's about 18 niggas over there. These niggas trying to pull up. I might hit two of them. Come on. Nah, you know. We getting active. Alright. Oh yeah, one more. Oh yeah. Aw, oh, glad niggas. <laughs> oh, glad Please. niggas. <laughs> hey, hey, you my ass on the camera. What? Hey, you too. Yeah, I can do it. I'm a doctor. I gotta take over. Nate Dog gonna take over everybody. 